seaweed arami and the tofu well it looks like tofu it's fake tofu it's made out of cashew um, the really dark green is kale and I know on the bottom is uh, mixed baby greens and uh, actually it says here there's red pepper and the tahini dressing so it's not turmeric it's red pepper Mine is what's called a uh, dog town. It's got avocado, some dulls, and got tomato in there. Tomato, cilantro, some scallions, and sprouts and sea cheese. Yeah. yeah, we have a. Oh, that's chocolate cake. It's a chocolate jungle peanut. Um, peanut butter a, cake. Peanut butter cake. I believe it's um, raw cacao. Um, Organic jungle raw peanuts. And, uh, I believe it's it's sweetened by coconut nectar. Um, and I think some cacao nibs as well. We have a little ball here. Yeah, we have a little ball here. <laughs> we didn't order it. Just, <laughs> it's just it magically appeared. I think it's made it's um, made from almond butter. Uh, Possibly some, uh, maybe raw blueberry. And again, coconut nectar, I think that's what they use. They, what they use at the sweet and everything, they don't use agave at all. I have uh, nachos, which is um, obviously made of avocado and tomatoes and a base of uh, walnuts. And I don't know if the crackers have any, uh, what are the crackers made out of, let's say. It says uh, you got creamy sea cheese, salsa, cashew mayo, and those are blue corn chips. Okay. And then, oh, it's walnut taco meat. So walnut based. And then we have the famous Carlos. Uh, Greek pizza. Greek pizza, what is it? Pizza, here we go. Greek flat bread pizza? Yeah. Color leaf, onion bread crust topped with Greek olives, sun dried tomatoes, red onions, red peppers, basil, olive oil with a side of marinated greens. What? That sounds yummy, yummy. I understand you guys, you are a kind of addict to euphoria. How often do you come? Uh, twice a day, all my days. Twice a day? At least two, sometimes three times a day. Oh my gosh. <laughs> sometimes, you know. Oh my gosh. <laughs> We're addicted because, you know, we lost so much weight, like I was saying from the other interview. Uh, I mean, I've been able to keep off. I lost the weight on mostly organic, but then I added vegan. I'm about 90%, 80% vegan, and I still have meat, but I haven't lately. But I've maintained to keep the, the 65 pounds off completely now. So, but what is, uh, to me it's a contradiction. You eat like a heaven every day, you enjoy life, and, uh, and you don't gain weight. I know. Huh? I mean, it's, it's not, again, it's not the food uh, like, the, like this. Look at this beautiful cake. Thank you so much. Yeah. Thank you. Okay. Hey, what I noticed, I was telling my wife, hey, many times, not sometimes, when we came here or we go to another raw food restaurant, I overeat. And I don't feel the, uh, the heaviness that I used to feel before with the, the cook food. Uh -huh. So it's okay to indul indulge a little bit. Oh, absolutely. But you can digest it faster so you don't Oh, yes, I can fast. digest faster. Well, we're living proof that, you know, we really do come here two, two, sometimes three times a day. But we come here twice a day and we have at least one cake that we share plus some chocolate. Mm -hmm. So, I mean, we, we should really be a little bit more overweight, but, you know. Again, it's real food. People usually go to the fast food restaurant because it's cheap. Because they, in, in a month, I don't know, they spend maybe $100 and they eat every day in fast food restaurant. And we are spending more money here, obviously. And it's not much more. But on the long run, what I always tell, I work in a cancer clinic, what is more expensive? Be healthy or be sick? Right. If you don't eat the right thing, sooner or later you're gonna get sick. So, and it's, cost, it's going to cost much more money. 